old coin season april 2020 welcome back guys it's crypto rocker from rockstar trading channel in today's video guys i'll be sharing with you three techniques i use to predict altcoin season it could be a mini one i'm not saying it's gonna be like the 2017 one i'm not sure if we'll ever get an altcoin season like that but we've had really decent mini altcoin seasons where you know coins cardano Chainlink, matic they have doubled gone up loads so i made one about four months ago that worked really well we'll have to see if this one works as well so so I'll share with you three things I use to predict whether we're going to get a mini altcoin season if you want to call it. I'm going to talk about some coins that I'm buying, some strategies. I'll be sharing with you exactly which coins I'm looking to buy. And also guys, I'll be making a very special announcement on the coronavirus as well. So without further ado, let's get into the video. The first uh, indicator that I use is Bitcoin. So if Bitcoin is consolidating that is good for altcoins and that is the first thing that i'm looking at and the way it's looking bitcoin has been consolidating and i think it can be consolidating for a bit longer so if, if bitcoin is in this range for uh, the next month or so then that could be quite good for altcoins we've already seen xrp is one that's gone up quite a bit i think it's been one of the better performing coins uh, we've seen a few others that has done well as well i'm looking at bitcoin cash i'll talk about that but that's one of the first things i look for so bitcoin consolidating if bitcoin breaks out of here guys then uh, this video uh, won't age well and i won't be looking to buy altcoins if bitcoin uh, does not it uh, does have a huge breakout or breakdown whichever happens at the moment i'm my bias is short bitcoin if you watch my previous videos or if you followed me on social media on youtube twitter i do make regular posts this was a zone i said is very key uh, i posted it last night and bitcoin has uh, dropped about four percent from that so we'll have to see guys what bitcoin does the second thing I look for is Ethereum. I mainly look at some of the other uh, key altcoins like XRP, LTC and Ethereum. If they start performing well, that can indicate that money could be going into altcoins. So that's another thing that I look for, guys. Um, at the moment, guys, Bitcoin's been the only one making big moves and I've mainly been trading uh, Bitcoin. I have given some free signals, uh, I think three fix signals that's worked really well. But mainly I've been trading Bitcoin and we have called Bitcoin quite well. So at the moment, Ethereum, Bitcoin, is the second uh, key thing that I look for if ethereum breaks out like this guys uh, then it would be bullish for altcoins and I'm gonna I'm going through this video fairly quickly the next thing that I look for is Bitcoin dominance chart let's find that out for you So Bitcoin dominance chart is at resistance and it could potentially be breaking down here. So if Bitcoin dominance chart, as you can see, it's already had another fall. If it breaks below this level, guys, that could mean altcoins are going up. Uh, Bitcoin has a uh, dominance chart has been going up since the start of uh, March. I mean, since the start of the year, really. Um, and it's, it's it could be going down if it breaks below. That would be another reason why altcoins will be doing well. So we have to keep an eye out for that so that's the prediction that i like to make the three things that i use if those three things happen guys i will be posting a lot more uh, altcoin indicators altcoin trade signals free and if you're part of the group guys i'll share exactly i'm going to share out i don't want to talk about it's an after the fact i'll share exactly um what i'm uh, the coins that i'm trading before that guys i'm doing a, a corona a charity giveaway so next month any uh, people that join i'm going to donate 100 percent of that uh, to the charity if it's a yearly then i'll donate half of that and then if you want to join the group guys uh, the, the price is still at only $20 and it's for a great cause coronavirus is very dangerous and it's a great time if you're staying home uh, to learn trading also guys if you can't donate that's fine but please stay at home we've got elderly family that you're at risk so if you can't donate that's fine but please stay at home or share with someone uh, that that can donate if you if they don't want to be part of the group they're not into trading or cryptocurrency uh, they can just pay the uh, charity directly they don't have to pay me if you're interested in tra trading i've got a full cryptocurrency course that i'm releasing here guys and uh, loads of other strategy videos and the unit section of it and in the group like i'll share with you now I do post a lot of signals beforehand. I don't say it's an after the fact. There's other people in the group as well. So this was the uh, Koto, Koti, Koti or Koto signal, whichever you want to call it. Koti signal that I posted. And this is the levels that I was looking to buy. And let's see how that worked. 
So Koti is a, one of the coins that I'm looking to buy. Uh, keep an eye out for Koti. At the moment, it's, it's come back. So look at that. I posted it here. It had a huge 15% move. At the moment, it's gone back below my 236 Fibonacci. But this is one of the coins that I am looking out for. If we can get back above 236 and, and the breakout zone, I think this can carry on. It hit my first target of 300. My next target was 350, which is so first target was 300 next was 350 it hit 300 perfectly again i'm not saying all my trades are going to be winners guys but this is one of the trades that worked really well another one that we took that worked quite well is xrp guys i know there's a lot of xrp fans and again it's not just a group watch the previous xrp video that worked really well guys xrp had a really nice move up the reason why i was liking xrp was this breakout and the signal what we wait for my trading strategy is a pullback to the moving average that's what i teach in the course and that happened perfectly guys it's really good to see xrp going that well sometimes it works sometimes it doesn't and again this is not after the fact it was march 27th um i shared that exact range of when to buy and it was before the breakout as you guys can see so what are my thoughts on xrp i think xrp can keep going higher as long as it doesn't break below 16 so this is still in play if we break above 18 cents i think that could be bullish for altcoins like i said bigger altcoins um, especially ethereum but xrp litecoin as well that can be looking quite juicy so keep an eye out for xrp Another one that I'm really liking is Litecoin, guys. Uh, let's see. I don't just buy uh, traditional chart patterns. If you guys know, I'm not a huge fan of them. I do keep an eye out for them, and I do post them on Twitter in the group. I don't as much because I don't use it, but people like to follow it. I'd rather have a breakout back above 236 Fibonacci, and then uh, if Litecoin breaks out, that will be definitely be bullish for altcoins. So keep an eye out for Litecoin as well. Ada is another one. I'm not sure whether to share this one or not. Um, this is the red zone i made the last video i talked about this um ada is in a key zone if you are in ada guys make sure it doesn't break below uh, and and hold below if it spikes down that's great if it spikes down that's great but if we break below it guys that's not going to be very good so keep make sure it doesn't do that like rvn has has done that guys and we don't want to see that happen because we can drop a lot further if uh, rvn get back above it then great but just to show you an example when things break below we don't know how low it can go so we have to be very careful even if you're hodling you like the project wait for a technical setup guys this in cryptocurrency guys technical analysis and the trading strategy that i teach works really well another one is bat uh, this is one of the ones that i'm interested in uh, i was waiting for it to close above the daily moving average it hasn't done icx and enj are two good ones um you could look to buy icx here with stop below and ENJ is another one that is in an uptrend. Uh, if you watch the previous live stream, I gave a signal on ENJ to buy this support. Uh, I don't know if you had bought it. That's it. Uh, I do free live streams as well. I'll do this one. I'll do live streams uh, three, four times a week in the educational group. And uh, there's other people sharing information. But I do at least a couple of live streams a month on YouTube. So make sure you subscribe and turn on the notification button. I talked about this. Uh, this could be setting up, guys. This is broken above, staying above it. If it can hold above this level, guys, this could be a potential goer. So ENJ, I've not made the top five videos. Usually I make a top five uh, videos for the month. I always make them and they've been working quite well. I will make one for YouTube, but I wanted to just wait a couple more days, see how things uh see how things pan out because if we don't get that breakout guys then it, it might not be that bullish so i'm just waiting a little bit before i release that video but these are some of the coins uh, that are on my radar and you can see some coins that are going well this was another one i think i shared uh, and that's Oh, it didn't hit target but you should have taken some off at about 13 percent profit and it's, it's going up again so that this could be a v, v chain could be one link and tezos i always look at them they're not looking as good um, i wanted them to get back above a big resistance level we've not been able to do that so i'm keeping an eye out for them so that's the main ones guys i'm mainly looking at stock market so i share a lot of information on live stream on stock market and, and share the core the, the forex pairs that i'm trading so it's not really just an altcoin group so if you want to trade forex and crypto and whatever i share those information as well and the main thing we've been doing lately has been trading
trading Bitcoin, guys, because Bitcoin has been going quite well. And I've shared the Bitcoin Cash. That was another one. I'll talk about that. But Bitcoin, I've been sharing signals on how I trade Bitcoin. And a couple of them have worked really well. I'm, I'm still biasly short. You can see entries and that worked well. So I'll leave the link below, guys. And it's for a good cause uh, with the coronavirus. So if you're interested, guys, I'll, I'll, I'll talk about that at the end of the video. One of the other ones that we are in or I'm in is... Uh, uh, Bitcoin Cash. I bought it here. It's above about seven percent up, uh, but it's more of a longer term play. If we do get that mini altcoin season, I know people that are on YouTube, uh, more the people that can't trade, will buy it when it breaks out here, and then it will drop. I like to position myself. My strategy is if we can get above the red zone, but I know a lot of people can't stare at their desk like myself like 16 hours a day uh, if you can't i'll share some signals for longer term as well uh, that if you're not at your desk you can take advantage there are a few people in the group that can't trade like myself so they are in the group for these sort of trades again i'm not saying just it's i'm not uh, it's i'm not a trade signals group i'm not promising you'll make lots of money uh, but i will share with you a profitable strategy that will work over time so check that out guys that's the video so I'll, to sum it up i'll quickly sum up the video three things i look for is bitcoin consolidating ethereum uh, bitcoin going up or, or the bigger altcoins doing well and the last one is bitcoin dominance chart i've also shared with you some coins that i'm looking at so xrp uh, bitcoin cash um, vet enj icx i've shared with you some coins that i'm looking to trade as well so hopefully you guys enjoyed that video i'll quickly make this announcement then i'll end the video is the coronavirus so this month if people are joining uh, they can uh, the money that i get or it's, it's your money really i'll be donating to i've picked this charity but if there's any other charities uh, let me know and i could uh, look to pick that charity and if you're not interested in trading or if you know someone that wants to give charity no need to pay uh, on my trading group just directly pay the website guys it's, it's really to help people if coronavirus does affect uh, poorer countries i mean in the western world our medical system is quite good uh, we can cope with it better if it affects countries like africa asia where uh, you know the medical system is not great and in slums they live close together it, it could get really really bad so hopefully it gets i'm sure it will, will overcome it and uh, yes guys if you're interested like i said uh, this month um 100 percent of your money will be going into this charity and if you pay for the yearly then uh, the half of that will go to it as well so and if you want to pay directly if you're not interested in the group just pay directly to them because that saves fees paypal fees and the fees you pay so you, they you, you can just directly pay them as well so just wanted to make the announcement i'll talk about that in a bit again i don't know if i'll raise anything and my channel's not that big but and every little help i guess so if you're interested that and if you're interested in trading and helping uh, do check that out i'll leave all the links below so thank you very much guys i hope you guys enjoyed it uh, what is your thoughts guys do you think we will get an altcoin season uh, or mini altcoin season in april we'll have to see but if bitcoin if the three things that i said happen it, we could potentially get that so to end the video my question to you guys is what is your thoughts guys comment below one altcoin that you think will perform very well i will be releasing that top five video uh, in the next couple of days next week or uh, by end of this week so make sure you subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button so thank you very much for watching this video guys i hope you guys enjoyed it if you have enjoyed it guys smash that like button subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button if you want to join the groups and also help the charity this month make sure you check it out my one request is again you don't have to subscribe to my channel and join the group only thing is guys make sure you stay isolated uh, and protect our elders if you can't donate and uh, make sure you subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button so thank you very much for watching this video guys i hope you guys have enjoyed it and um, I'll see you guys soon with another great video. Thank you very much.